Hello guys! Um, so this red jacket is basically my costume, but welcome to the last day, the final day of the Disney Villains week. I did already do my hair and put on the crown. Um, another thing to remember is that I understand Queen of Hearts can be argued for and against being a Disney villain, but being as Alice in Wonderland, the live action was released under Disney, I thought it would count. So using this dark blue, we're going to go ahead and start with a wing. And how else have we done wings, but without our tape. Also, as per usual, I have sped up m different pieces of this process just for your convenience. And know that it did take longer to do this makeup than what is shown in the video. Next, I put light blue eyeshadow on the top of my eyelid. And we just finished that side, so we're going to just do it to the other side. Next, in the live action movie, she kind of has this big thing on her eyelids. So I took an even lighter blue and just added that on as well. Next, we are going to emphasize our cheekbones, and in the movie, she has a big, bright red showing the shaping of her face, and so we are going to do the same. I thought it would be easier just to use my finger to draw it where I needed it to go with the red eyeshadow. Of course, right after, you just got to blend it right in a little. Next, I use some red blush to add some color to my cheeks and to help the accentuation of the red lines. After that, I use some white eyeshadow to brighten up the cheekbones themselves above the line, just like her white makeup did for her. Next, for our lips, in most, not only in the cartoon, but in the regular movie, she had red heart lips. So we're going to use our red lip liner to kind of just draw out the heart. And I use the top arches of my lips to be the top part of the heart. And I did my best to connect them underneath for the bottom of the heart. It did, as you can see, come out a little sloppy, so I had to clean it up and readjust to fix it the way I wanted it to look. After that, just use some red lipstick to fill in the heart itself and do some touch-ups with the pencil. Now that we're done with that, I'm going to use the white eyeshadow on the outer sides of the lips just to make the heart more accentuated and make it blend in and look a lot nicer. Right after that, I just use the lip liner pencil to then do two dots and connect the dots at the bottom to make a nice heart on my cheek, just like she'd had in the movie. Next. 
And there you have it, a nice looking heart. I thought this look looked a lot nicer and a lot cleaner than what they had in the movie, so I hope you guys liked it. And I have one final thing to say. And that is... Off with her head. Thanks, guys. See you next time.